Hey everyone, so it's almost the end of 2018. I have no idea where this year has gone, but I wanted to drop in and, and talk to you um, about something really incredible and special. And that is that in 2018, I discovered flow. And this is basically where when our energy is in flow with the universe, we attract an abundant life with ease. It was my biggest learning from 2018. And I discovered that intense, overwhelming struggle, that hardship that I'd experienced previous to last year, I'd actually created myself. So I wanted to ask you before I go into this final live video of 2018, you know, do you feel like there is a void in your life or a sadness that you you can't quite find the words to describe, but you feel it? Are you knee deep in hardship like I was and you're, you're just done with struggle and you're ready to leave that way of life behind? And, you know, are you feeling worry, frustration, jealousy, guilt or any other negative emotion rather than feeling joy and at peace? And are you sick to the back teeth of feeling like you don't have enough? That you're not achieving what you think you're capable of and, you know, you're feeling just fed up with the fact that those successes that you always hoped you'd have, they're just not eventuating into your life. Because in 2017, I was exactly in that place. I was suffering financially, I was torturing myself mentally and emotionally, and I was really being blocked by limiting beliefs that I had created out of past experiences that had hurt me. And I was generally unfulfilled and generally unhappy. And I was working on absolutely everything outside of myself, you know, downloading the quick fix strategies and doing the marketing campaigns and working like I was on a hamster wheel for hours on end trying to, you know, bring my business up out of the ground and, and nothing was working. I was looking everywhere apart from inside of myself for the secret source to my own success. And the stupid thing was that really, at the time, I didn't even have any idea why I was doing it. I, I couldn't see. I couldn't see past the end of my nose to what the vision of my life looking better looked like. I was just so deep in struggle, so suffocated by money worries, and so disbelieving of my own capabilities that, yeah, like I say, I couldn't see past the end of my nose and I just wanted the struggle to go away so that I could pay the next bill and put some food on the table for my girls. So when we're feeling this way, all those negative emotions create an energetic conflict between where we are and where we want to be. And when we finally, to, finally start to lift our head out of the parapet and start to see what we want in our lives, this energetic conflict blocks that success, that success manifesting. Um, and you know, to, to free ourselves from this block, to live that life that we truly want to be living, we've got to clear the, the, the resistance to our own optimism and feelings of joy. So that our vibration, our own energetic vibration is, is raised to match that of the vision that the universe is, universe is holding for us so that we attract that abundance easily. So what I'm telling you is, is really important and you know, grab a pen and see this as your, your aha moment. The first important step begins in our mind. It begins up here in our imagination as we craft the vision of the life we want for ourselves and the, the person who we actually really want to become. And I, I teach you in my manifestation challenge that it's not the detail of that vision, but it's actually the feelings, the emotions that vision creates that are the key to our success in manifesting that vision into our life. Because every time we feel good, our vibration is rising. 
So this is why I teach you also in the Manifestation Challenge about gratitude and about how to feel that appreciation as you go through your day-to-day -day life because it's one of the, the most powerful but most overlooked ways to swap out any negative feeling at any time like anger, frustration or fear, all those emotions that lower our, our vibration to replace them with feelings of appreciation and raise our vibration instead. So do you know the difference between somebody who attracts abundance easily into their life and somebody who continually struggles? Or do you know the difference between the me in 2017 who was struggling to the different me that sits here in front of you now in the present who is succeeding? mindset, an abundance mindset over a, po a poverty mindset, a positive mindset over a negative mindset, a resilient mindset over one that is weak and defeated, and a mindset that is limitless. An abundant, positive, limitless, resilient mindset thinks different thoughts to the one that is wrapped up in struggle, focused on the have-nots, and easily affected by negativity. It's different to a mindset that is limited. And these distinguished thought patterns lead to distinguished habits that create those feelings of abundance in spite of what is happening around us and attract more abundance in. It's an inside job. The, par the parting of ways with struggle and negativity and the reconnection with yourself and discovery of what makes your soul dance. So what next? Another year is upon us and I want to work closely with you to make sure it's as transformational for you as this last one has been for me. I want to offer you the opportunity to, to stop trying to work it out all yourself, figure it out for yourself like I was, and learn from my experience of fast-tracking my own success by looking within. So your first step, your first step, again, grab that pen, this is, this is key, it's to know, it's to get to know what you want intimately and describe that vision in detail not in the detail of, you know, the nuts and bolts, but in how you feel, how it makes you feel, attaching those emotions that, that, that make it within you like it's already happening to you, and also discover what makes your soul dance, and, and just keep doing more of that. <laughs> and step two, it's to stop letting your limiting beliefs hold you back from taking action towards that vision. You know, you're being called towards your vision for a reason. Your soul dances when you do certain things for a higher purpose. And you've been through what you've been through because those experiences have greater meaning in your life and are the greatest power that you have in creating the future that you want. But you have to find your flow first. Your, your place where you feel good more than you feel bad and you feel good most of the time. It's a place where you can easily surrender and detach in the moment from those things that, that pull you out of your flow. The frustration, the anger, the regret, disappointment or any negative emotion that comes in. It's a place where how you feel about the action you know you need to take towards your goals, you feel empowered, you feel confident and you feel grateful. And it's appreciation that you, you have the unique gifts that you have and you've experienced what you did to, to develop them. So how much would it change your life right now to flow and to attract that abundance into your life with ease and lose any sense of need, any sense of struggle and any sense of frustration? How would it feel to have peace of mind? And how would it feel to have the fear you carry about doing what you need to do to, to transform your life? How would it feel to, to feel that fear and do those things anyway, rather than being held back? And you know, fear that's at the crux of it. 
in my experience, whether you know it, whether you admit it, whether you're able to use that description of it, fear is in play in so many ways in our life when it comes to us not st taking steps forward to what we want and the place where we want to be. Because our experiences, those experiences that we've had in the past, the things that people have said to us, um, how that has made us feel, what it has made us believe about ourselves, the roles that we've taken on, the obligations we have felt and the, the mistakes that we have made, they become our reality as we remember them and create stories that we tell others about and, and tell ourselves about on repeat. But we have the ability to change our reality by changing our thoughts. And there's a, a powerful section in my online course, From Fear to Fears, that shows you how to do this literally by rewiring your brain. And I share three powerful mindset tweaks that you can make immediately to, to start feeling that, that transformation in your mindset right away. And this section of my course is based on a well-studied area called neuroplasticity. Um, it's fast becoming my, my number one passion to learn more about. And the theory is that whatever the brain can envision, it can create. So if we can imagine it, we can attract it. And we can literally um, create and erase our neural pathways. We can literally change the reality around us with our thoughts. And we can change the essence of who we are just by using our imagination about, about what we want to be and who we want to become. And we can harness our brain's neuroplasticity, which basically means just using how it physically creates and stores thoughts in our favor. So that's pretty cool. And I know just by hearing that, that you, uh, you're going to want to get your hands on this, this course just from that module. Um, but you're telling yourself that, that you can't afford it or it's, it's not a priority right now. And you've seen me advertise about it and you've thought exactly those things like I can't afford it it's it's not the right time for me it's it's not a priority so I want to offer you as my parting gift for 2018 I want to offer you the opportunity to get your mindset in the right place and and have some tools and resources for your own success in 2019 so today and literally through to the end of New Year's Eve my course, my From Fear to Fierce online um, course is available to you through the link that is in the body of this video for just $24.95. That's New Zealand dollars. And I know it's a ridiculous price and it does not reflect the value that I have poured into that course at all. But I just want this online life-changing resource in the hands of as many people as possible as they contemplate what they're doing with 2019 and how it's going to be different for them so that you know you can create a clear vision of what your life looks like in the next 12 months and who you are as happy and fulfilled making the impact that you're destined to make on this world and experiencing all that the universe is keeping safe for you right now you know so that you can develop that deep self-awareness that is always going to help you to understand your path forward and intuitively and also find peace with what's gone before you know i want you to be able to control those thought patterns so that they they are helpful and they're not toxic to your peace of mind and abundance and I want you to be able to easily create a success plan, a plan of action that is literally going to have a charge of powerful women marching forwards towards their dream life, aligned to their purpose, so that there's a ripple effect. That, that's my goal for 2019. Because the sad truth, and maybe you won't like me saying it, but I don't care, <laughs> It's, it's that 95 to 97% of people, they live this year, they'll live this coming year on repeat 
of the last one. And they'll get to this time next year wondering why it all went so wrong and why they're ex in exactly the same place as they were 12 months ago. They'll still feel that void, that sadness that, that they can't describe. They'll still feel frustrated and knee deep in struggle. There'll be new struggles that weren't even there before because they will have attracted them. And they're baffled as, as to how they've attracted that bad luck. And they're asking themselves the same question. Why so much bad shit keeps happening to them year on year. But I know that nothing happens to us. It happens around us and it is how we respond based on, on you know the health of our mindset that decides the impact that it has on our life and our vibe. Our unrelenting, positive, happy vibe and our energy that is in flow with the universe and the vision that it is delicately and lovingly holding on to us while we do the need the work that we need to do to level up to it. And, you know, you might have seen that I chose a word for 2019 and that word was up level. And I'm, that's because I'm not, the, I'm not there yet, you know. I'm still working on my inside job alongside you guys. It just might be that I'm a little bit further ahead or maybe I'm not. But I'd love you to share with me whether you chose your word and, and what that word is. Um, you can share it in my group, It's Our Time, and I'll post the link again in the body of this video, and you can use the, the hashtag MyOneWord. So you can then go along and grab your discounted From Fear to Fierce course, which is 95% discounted until the end of New Year's Eve. So you can get it for 24 95 New Zealand dollars and you can start taking the steps to transform your life by transforming you. And if you're crazy and you don't want to take that offer, then I invite you to jump on my manifestation challenge instead. That one's a freebie um, and I cover at the very least vision and gratitude so it will be helpful to you. And my final parting gift for the end of this year is to be able to get four coaching sessions, one-on-one, face-to-face, -on -one, -face, either um, in person or online, for a discount as well. So I'm discounting four sessions by 20%. And you know, this is a great thing to have alongside From Fear to Fierce. Because if you're the type of person who's going to struggle to commit to doing the course online and need a bit of accountability, we can obviously work together on the things that you're covering in the course in our one-on-one -on -one sessions, along with anything else that you want to do. Or you can just take that bundle independent of, of the online course and set some goals for 2019, really figure out what that vision of success looks like for you, what is holding you back and, and how you're, you're going to go forward. Um, in four sessions, we can really get to grips with that. Many of my clients, most of my clients feel significant shifts in just three to four sessions with me. Um, and most of my clients by se seventh or eighth, seventh or eighth session, they're feeling, you know, a, a significant um, transformation in their life. And most of them fly away, I guess, like a butterfly out of chrysalis at this point. But then there, there, there's others that, that carry on and we coach long, long term because they see the benefit of working with somebody side to side and having somebody to be accountable to and bounce ideas off. And I guess... Um, work as goals shifts, the goals shift as they do, and also as life happens, which it does. So let me know what is going to help you. Let me know your word for 2019. And to summarize, today you can get from fear to, from fear to fierce for just twenty four ninety five. New Zealand dollars, which is 95% off the listed price. You can get that by visiting the link in the body of this video. And you can get four coaching sessions with me face to face or online for just $2.99, which is a 20% discount. Um, and that deal is actually going to run through January, all sessions booked in January. 
And you can find a link to my manifestation challenge, which is free and which is really fun to do and will really shift you forward in, in manifesting success in your life. 2019 has absolutely extraordinary things in store for all of us. So let's give ourselves the best chance to be in receipt of this New Year's abundance. I'm working hard on me and I've got incredible stuff coming in the new year that's just going to blow 2018 out of the water and help you, I hope, um, in many ways. So I will leave you in your high vibes and your happiness and wish you all the best for the new year and much love. Thanks. Bye-bye.